This is a demonstration video of the Fidelity record player. I'm just going to show you how to use it so you'll be familiar with it when you receive it. When you receive it, the first thing to do is screw down the two transit screws on the deck located here and here. Screw those down fully clockwise so that the deck floats on its springs. The arm clip releases automatically when the start position is engaged and locks again when the turntable stops. On the front are the two main controls for on-off volume and tone and on the deck you have the speed control here, stop start control here and on the right hand side the switch for 7, 10 or 12 inch record selection. You can load between 1 and 6 records, I'll demonstrate with 2 just so you can see it play. Pop the records onto the spindle ledge and put the stacker arm across, select the correct speed and size and then to start the auto changer flick the switch down to auto. If you want to skip to the next record, just flip the switch to auto again. Just demonstrate with the start of a 12 inch record as well. the arm lifts off automatically when it reaches the end of the record. If you don't want to use the auto changer and you just want to play one record manually, you can just pop an individual record down the spindle onto the platter and with the stacker bar in the upright position you can flick the switch to auto and the arm will move across or you can select manual start so that the turntable starts to turn and you can then place the arm onto the record yourself. Once the arm is on the record and it's playing, carefully lower the stacker arm down so it knows to switch off automatically at the end of the record. If you leave it playing with the stacker bar left in the upright position like so, that triggers the repeat function and the same record will play over again. So I hope that covers everything for you, but if you do have any questions when you receive it, I'll include my personal email address in with the machine and please use that method to contact.